Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophonet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Dead March difficulty. Last time we were led downstairs beneath the bathhouse to the vault by Sigi Reuven or Dijkstra as you will himself. Uh, the vault was guarded by this troll here, Bart, and we need to investigate what hides beyond this broken wall. Problem is, there's a uh, toxic mold in the in these caves, in these sewers, and therefore we need to drink something called a pops mold uh, antidote. So, heading in, we've also heard rumors about something inside a monster. Let's start the investigation now, shall we? Explosion crumpled it like a piece of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Last tore it from the wall. Okay. Can this door be opened? No, it's locked. Let's continue. I need to keep an eye on the timer, because uh, if that antidote works out, I'm going to be in trouble. Bits of pipe clear over here. Must have been one powerful blast. Well, we can hear something down here. There's drowners. Question is, this will probably be explosive. Show me what you got, drowners. Of course. There goes one. Next attempt. It seems I can use Igni without completely exposing myself. So that will make things a bit easier. That goes a lot smoother now, doesn't it? And those 15 other drivers don't show up. Okay, there's a pipe. Couldn't push much through that. So that's the same type of pipes that we found something, some pieces of over there. And there's a lot of loot here. I am assuming that there's something else here besides the drowners. Because I don't think a seasoned veteran like Dijkstra would run away at the sight of a few drowners. Although of course I could be wrong. As I have been before. Doesn't seem to be anything here. Oh, there's the guy he left for dead. Okay, he doesn't look too good. I need to keep an eye on my antidote counter. So that I don't get the same fate. This place is pretty big. There's someone Teacher else here. Didn't mention anyone else. Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Vomit everywhere. Guess he had the antidote too. Couldn't keep it down in there. 
I don't know why that drowner over there is on fire, but well, he is. There they go. Um, according to the map, there are a lot more of those running around here. But they must be up top, I suppose. Okay then. Two minutes on the antidote counter. I'm gonna check up top. No secret walls, okay. Go. Locked as well. Okay. And let's continue this downstairs again. There's nothing behind this grate, so. Must be going this way. Oh, another clue. Hmm, bottom of a container. Silver cylinder, most likely. Runes etched in the bottom. It's warped, probably by the explosion. Bomb part. Must be. Smells like wyvern oil and caramel. Caramel? Gold okay. coin. Trail ends here. Dandelion must have loaded the treasure onto a boat. Or so it seems, because we are back outside. Apparently at the edge of the city. Let's see if we can't find anything of value in here. Marcus Boots. Okay, that's a weird spot. Never mind, so let's get back. Although I do want to check out what's in here. So let's head back to Geekstra and tell them what we found. Although it is weird that there appear to be enemies here, but. Hmm. Oh, we missed this. They came through here. A pearl. There's another one. And a ring. Dandelion's cohorts were either clumsy or in a big hurry. So maybe I missed a few things. Is there something I missed? Oh, over here. Edges curled out. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall too. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here. That so they dumped something here. in the bath. Time to see Dijkstra. So they used the bath to blow open the pipe, which they knew led outside to this wall. Very, very smart. Okay, Bart. See you next time. So I'm back inside the bathhouse. I'm jumping again. People seem to still have cleared out, so that's good for us. But let's go see Dijkstra in his office. Hello, Happen. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Well, I've, uh, I'm done investigating. Done. Examined every nook of the sewers near your vault. Well, learn anything? Yeah, we did. Someone dropped a bomb down your drain. Bits of treasure dropped out of the crates, left a clear trail. You know, like the fairy tale with the crumbs. Hansel mm, and Gretel. I know the one. Hansel, Gretel, burning witches. Very fitting for Novograd. Trail leads to the river where the sewer lets out. Breaks off there. My bet, they loaded the treasure onto a boat. Yeah. A cart drawn by sewer rats does seem unlikely. And since boats don't leave trails, 
it amounts to fuck all. Okay, very friendly. Found a second corpse, one of the thieves. Threw up the antidote just like your man Fonts. A beautiful death. Anything on the body? Not, Not that we much. found. Empty vial. Hmm. Wouldn't have left him behind if he was anybody. Common porter, must be. Knew nothing, means nothing. Dead end. Literally. Okay, but we did find the bomb. Seems to me a bomb blew the wall open. Look. Bottom of a silver cylinder, probably. Covered in runes. Interesting. Any idea what it contained? Recognized some ingredients by their scent. Wyvern oil and sugar. Sugar? Geralt, I'm in no mood for jests. We aren't. It was caramel. Nor am I. Just saying what I found. Bomb contained sugar. Let's think. Sugar would react violently with sulfuric acid, but not so violently to cause an explosion. Didn't know you were versed in alchemy. Dabbled in it a bit while at Oxenford Academy. But this is no time to reminisce. You're to find my treasure, not write my biography. Okay, take you know it anything easy, else Dixon. about this bomb? Anything at all? Well, it was inside the pipes. It bomb went off inside house. a drainage pipe embedded in the vault wall. But the grate at the end of the pipe was in place when the blast happened. Meaning... The bomb must have found its way into the pipe from inside the bathhouse. Exactly. Might have gone something like this. Perpetrator started emptying one of the pools, then dropped the bomb down the drain. The bomb flowed down with a runoff, came to rest on the grate, and, to quote Bart, big boom. Yes, indeed. Drain pipes are only promising lead. We just need to know which pool it's connected to. Yes. And that's where our witcher senses come keeps in. a record of guests. Should be able to tell us who used that pool the day of the break-in. You've not done badly. Well, of course we have to be acknowledged. Oh, that famous sarcasm. I missed it. Really? Hmm. About as much as I'd miss a knife in my knickers. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dijkstra. The eternal sarcasm. All right. You inspect the pools on the right. I'll take the ones on the left. Holler if you find anything. Yes, we will. So. And we leveled up, apparently. Nothing here. We'll first level up. So we leveled up, but no extra slot yet. Um, I do like the arrow parrying, so I might as well start preparing for when I do get that next slot. And I wanted to uh, improve my oils because the bomb upgrades I use a lot of bombs but the bomb upgrades aren't really handy at the first stage they just allow us to uh, slow time a bit further when we're aiming our bombs so let's see let's start with the oil prep preparation now shall we acquire ability so we're not going to equip that yet, because I think uh, the arrow deflection is handier at the moment. Just in case we come across some archers. There we go. So this seems to be promising. Something floating on the surface. Oil looks like. That looks like something that people might have noticed before, since it's a giant oil slick inside the bathtub. So let's get in the bath and check the pipe itself, I think. Oh, there we go. Silver lid matches the cylinder bottom I found in the sewer. Dijkstra, come here. Yeah, we found something all right. Got something? Yeah, bomb part. Happen. Drain pool four, and bring me the guest book. Chop, chop. Okay. Yeah, maybe we should ask him if he trusts this uh, Happen character. Either way, 
What about Happen? Could have overheard you mention the vault, has access to the bathhouse whenever he wants. Happen has numerous flaws. He's pompous, pretentious, can be a real prick sometimes. Ironic as that may sound. But his loyalty is beyond he's a question. eunuch, probably. How can you be so sure? Witches know their monsters. Spies know their men. You trusted Philippa Eilhart once, too. Ooh, don't push True. it. But I didn't pull Philippa Eilhart out of a Kaviri prison the night before her execution. Okay, then. That was a sneer, but let's move on. Let's see what's on the bottom. There's happened with the ledger. Grate's been removed from the drain, meaning they flushed the bomb down here. Happen? Who used this pool the day of the break-in? Let me see. Uh, Bertolt Heinz, town councilman, Josef Schweik, brewer, and Margrave Henkel. Henkel? That's impossible. Oh, why is that? Impossible? Why? Old Coach has been eating dirt since last winter. Couldn't have been here the day of the break-in. He's Ooh. dead. I'd not heard. Not surprising. The Honourable Margrave croaked in a brothel, decked out in leather lingerie. Ooh. So the family held a hush's <laughs> funeral. But I have my sources. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him that fateful day, Mr. Reuven. I'm certain of it. Did you speak to him? Get a good look at him? No. You merely passed by on the way in. So you didn't see Henkel. You saw an impersonator. Think for once. They scooped out your balls, not your brain. Ooh. And you, Geralt, start looking into this. So we might already assume that since Happen is quite sure that he saw Mr. Henkel enter the bathhouse, that we must be dealing with a Doppler. Fine. Where should I start? Henkel's home. Derelict townhouse south of the main square. You might happen on some trace of this scoundrel we're looking for there. Well, off with you. Okay, okay, take it easy. He's not a really friendly man, is he? So, let's get back outside. And let's go check out Mr. Henkel's house. Apparently Mr. Henkel lives just off the main square where they're burning uh, people alive. So let's check this place out. What a dump. Looks more like a beggar's hovel than a Margrave's townhouse. So let's and blast the door open. Some interesting friends. Okay. There we go. Seems like there was Quick someone friends. here. Okay, Geralt. Very interesting, but... Is this a chest I can open? No. Look around a bit. Take all the crap I can. Silver cylinder. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. Not just the bottom, even the parts. The parts look pretty alike, so uh, I think we're on the right track. I'm gonna ignore the bookcases, maybe this chest. There we go. Let's follow the footsteps upstairs. Now shall we? What's this? A letter. And a bottle. Okay, a bottle of wine. Don't know how that would be evidence. The wine from your birth year. It's absolutely excellent. Startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. Your birth year. Could be dandelions. Or series. So we can see the footsteps leading towards a false door already. I'm gonna quickly read the note in full. There we go. The wine from your birth year. It's simply brilliant, startling bouquet. You absolutely must try it, but afterwards please place the bottle back where you found it. With love, from D. So D could be dandelion. Of course, it might be a ruse as well. There's a lot of bottles here. Seems to be ah, that's where the one's missing. Oh, I forgot about that. Twelve forty-five to twelve fifty-four. Let's put it back. Hmm. Satisfying click. 
in the next room over, I think. Satisfying click in the next room over, I think. That's a uh, catchy. I'm jumping for joy again. Yeah, there the false Secret wall room. opened. Probably where Dandelion and his cohorts planned the heist. Stain. Wyvern oil. Wyvern oil. So that's what the bomb was made of. A letter from Dudu. That's probably Siri. the infamous D. Menga is following me. He has seized the treasure. He has Dandelion. You must flee. Okay, so that explains a lot. Steps. Not good. So yes, indeed not good. But first, let's check this place out a bit. Since we might be able to find a few things extra. That's the bomb, of Sugar. course. And lumps of a substance dipped in wyvern oil. Hmm. Potassium. Looks like they made the bomb here. And Instructions not on how to build a bomb. Signed by one calc stain. Oh, so they did find the ingredient, uh, the recipe for the bomb with calc stain. Now for that letter. Siri, if you're reading these words, that means you have solved my riddle, for which you have my congratulations. It also means you have not yet been caught and are still in Novigrad, which worries me greatly. I do not know exactly what you did on Temple Isle, but Mange is furious and will not rest until he captures you skins you alive and burns you at the stake. And now that he's got his sanctimonious paws on Dijkstra's treasure, he can hire enough men to search every home in the city thrice over. I am a Doppler, so I will be able to hide. But you, you must flee while you still can. Your doo-doo. Yes, don't even think about trying to break Dandelion free from Mangi's clutches, it's impossible. But knowing our friend, he'll wriggle his way out somehow. Or at least, I hope he will. PPS, forgive me for not writing how to contact me, but A, you are to flee, remember, and B, militarily guards those who guard themselves. So Dudu is a, a Doppler that we've known from for quite some time, that Geralt met in Novigrad itself, I think, in one of the books, in one of the short stories, I think in The Last Wish, uh, and he has been a friend ever since, so he helped both Siri and Dandelion, and that's why uh, didn't Henkel... expect to see you here. So Hello, Triss. Triss. Henkel was at the bathhouse. Apparently, knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb. I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet wars, have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Yeah. We kinda know. So let's get to the point. Mange stole it. Father Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menga. Well, well, Merigo. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. Margrave Henkel told me everything. <laughs> okay, then. Henkel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. And Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist. So... Geralt, how can I put this delicately? Bollocks. If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. Yeah. Know you what well you enough to know results. what matters. Results. So I lied. Still say I can lead you to your treasure. Forgive me, Geralt, but after what you just pulled, I'd sooner believe a whore who proclaimed her undying love. Would you believe a sorceress who stands to gain if you get your coin back? Perhaps. I'd still prefer the whore, though. Yeah, I can believe You're that. You're hiding something, and that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. Yeah, because you're never hiding this something. This is a business deal, not a marriage. 
Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. Hmm. Menger has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menger spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. Okay, then. Doubt Menger will admit anything willingly. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive. With my treasure. Okay then. You're using us. In other words, you're using us. Using you? Never! Merely making the most of your mutual bond. <laughs> well, lovebirds, I really must be going. Good luck. Thought you'd correct him. Say that we... You know. Nothing he needs to know. Deekstra doesn't need to know about my love life. Wise. I'd never choose his shoulder to cry on either. But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Of course it is, whenever... When, got Dandelion locked up when, it, when is it when Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right. See you then. And thanks. Thank you, Driss. So, before that, of course, you know what's coming. We're gonna take a little break. Uh, okay. That was Triss bursting at the flame. But never mind. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more. Thank you guys again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye!